And so what I thought would be visually important in order to most accurately portray that would be to isolate Alan and Laura Marsh as completely as, as, as possible from their real world surrounding. We, um, we had worked on a, a project previously together, so we already kind of had knew each other somewhat. Um, a lot of rehearsals, um, and Frank just really, <laughs> you know, pounding out those scenes and just really getting the the connection. And we also did, you know, some improv and things to really get ourselves in the emotional mindset of of Alan and Laura. And um, it just, you know, in the moment, it just comes out how it comes out. And I'm I'm glad it came out great. So <laughs> she's my buddy. We just had great chemistry and uh, hung out. And the whole experience was really fun, emotional sometimes, but uh, it, was a, it was a wonderful experience. Yes. I thought it would be interesting to explore the plight of the secondary victim of such a violent crime. Um, and within that, explore the fragility of masculinity, which, and Frank and I, I should mention Frank and I really pounded the story out together and he evolved through collaboration. Um, you know, there's so much pressure on men to be strong, always, and to be the caretaker, the provider. But what do they do with those emotions that, that are under the surface, the anger and the helplessness? And so I, I really just, I wanted to explore that and in the end tell a story about hope and, and healing. Just keep doing it. No matter what anybody tells you, just keep doing it. But then again, I shouldn't have to be telling you that because if you're doubting, then you need to reconsider because you need to always have that drive in your gut and in your heart that tells you that you have to keep going or otherwise you wouldn't make it. And I think once you wake up every day thinking about making films, then you know you'll be on the right track and that's gonna be your career you need to take, so. I can't really follow that. I'm just gonna rephrase. <laughs> I'll rephrase that. Persevere and make sure you're doing it for the right reasons because you're passionate about it. And God, just write a good script. That's the failing of so many projects. It's, it's just dead from day one. Write a good story and the rest will fall into place. Advice as an actor? <laughs> Ditto. <laughs> Ditto. Awesome, well thank you so much guys. Thank you so much, thank you. Thank you, Eddie. Thank you. Um, the sc next screening I believe is Tuesday. Tuesday, Tuesday at, at four at the Angelica. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'm Eddie Tobias. Log on to showhorn.com to find out more what's happening at the Dallas International Film Festival.